how many of you, um, you know, have any thoughts or emotions towards what happened yesterday at the AFCON? Hmm. Um, hmm. I'm trying to be measured in, you know, the way I'm feeling and uh, how I want to express myself. Hmm. Elaine, hmm. you see, I have said, and I'll say it again here on this platform, that if Ghana progresses to the next stage of the AFCON, under the circumstances under which we are performing and playing and all of that, then it's contrary to all the natural laws of the universe. Hmm. Let me explain. You see, the days that manna fell from the sky, they are over long to gone. feed hungry people who have not planted seed in the ground, and yet they are eating, hmm. are over. Even the good book says, the Bible says, if a man will not work, he should not he eat. He should not eat. Mm. Now, the principle is simple. There's a way to win. And you're not going down that road. How do you expect to win? Listen, the black stars are not the problem. GFA. Yes, please. The they black are stars the are not the problem. problem. Let me ask you, uh, viewers, when was the last time you heard of the starlets? Hmm. You know, we had a, we had a team Star called the starlets. Black starlets. That is where we pick players from into the black stars. We had the satellites. We had the meteors. Yeah, meteors, they were there. And those are the ones who know our fields. Yeah. They know the skills. Where, what happened to all of, forget the black stars for now. Let's put them on a the shelf just for a few seconds, right? Let's ask, where are the starlets? You know, starlets won a World Cup. Mm -hmm. Not AFCON. Not AFCON. Not AFCON. World Cup. World Cup. We've won World Cup before. What this? The under 20s. Those they are the satellites. They've also won World Cup. I remember where I was. I was in Tamale at the time. I was living in Tamale, Vitin Estates. Listen, the, we, we actually had prayer meeting that evening. For eh? the starlets. No, 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 no for the starlets. We were doing, it you was were doing your own prayer meeting. Prayer meeting. Right. And I remember walking up and down that, and I had a, 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 a phone in my pocket that had radio. <laughs> And, and then you were I was, listening. Then I will listen to one. I say, hey, Charlie, the game is going well. Then I'll put it back in my pocket. Then we'll continue praying. Uh, then I'll take it out. Uh, now I'll listen again, get some <laughs> updates from the match. We won a World Cup at the satellite level. So we've won at two different two levels. Two different levels. Now, if you and I are being honest and sincere, the mathematics is not working. Hmm. How is it that a group of people facing their age mates hmm. can win at the World Cup? Hmm. Another group of people at the under 20s facing their age mates win a World Cup. Then you go to the you go to the blasters level, and the World Cup hmm. is elusive. I heard the World Cup. Now we've been to the World Cup, so let's leave that one to our side. Today, 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 where we find ourselves. What is it that is actually going on? Whatever we are seeing is criminal. Number one, I don't believe in the accusations that people are saying that the, the coach is whatever, get rid of him. No, the black stars and the coach are not your problem. The people who are administrators of this unit that went to the AFCON, they are the issues that we have to deal with. Because they are the decision makers. At the end of the day, it's easy for us to uh, use the coach as a whipping boy. Why do we decide that? Yes. Our own players mm. who play the league mm -hmm. cannot be picked, cannot be handpicked, selected carefully, yeah. trained properly yeah. over years mm. ahead mm. of an Afghan that we know is played mm. every two years. Every two years. Yeah. 
Why do we decide that we never plan ahead yeah. as a managing board, yeah. as Ghanaians? Yes. We never like to plan ahead. Yes. So we decide that the foreign players, yes. <clears throat> excuse me, they are yeah. better than the ones that we have well trained here. You want an answer? And we pay them extra. Do you, do and you want then an we answer? tell them we will give them 30,000, 40,000 dollars an when they play well. Is because they want to be paid, mm. then they decide to play well. Then when they score one, complacency is the set. No. Because One pay, I think they've scored 10. No, because it's business. So everything because, in Ghana has to be Because the business. GFA is made up of club owners. Hmm. And everybody wants their player to shine. To shine. Do you understand? Hmm. Here's the thing. If you take the starlets, right? If you eat the Colts, where, where, where where's, the where's Colts football? Colts football doesn't exist in Ghana anymore, right? If you took the players at Colts football level, 10-year-olds, 11-year-olds, 12-year-olds, and you groom them for the starlets. This same group of, let's say, 50 starlets players, right, will, will graduate to the next level. And then you, let's say, let's say out of the 50 starlets players, you have, let's say, 45, 40, 45 that make it to the satellite's level. Another 30, 35 make it to the meteor's level. By all means, about 20, 25 will make it to the black star's level. What it does is that it does not give people who are mm. thieving scoundrels the chance to manipulate their way and bring players who are not deserving into the black stars. Because of percentages. So, you have good black stars, no. Ah. But at the satellite level, we have collapsed the entire structure. The structure that won us four Afcons. Four Afcons. And we are using and hoping that God, by some miraculous means, God of miracles for Ghana. The God of miracles who only favors Ghana. Ghana. And not other and countries. We are hoping that by some stroke of luck, you will do international fefe kobo. <laughs> and then it will work <laughs> by magic. It doesn't work. If Blasters was to win the AFCON, it will go against every natural mm. law of the universe. The natural laws of the universe are simple. Whatever you sow, you, you reap. reap it. We, what you are seeing at the Afcon is a right. reaping of what we have sown. For years. And that's why I'm saying that it will go against every natural law because you cannot reap what you have not sown. If we have not planted a seed at a grassroots level and graduated them through the stages, different stages, which is how we won the previous Afcon, don't expect... And please, me, I just beg before all Ghanaians, let's stop blaming the black stars. They haven't done anything. They are and sitting there coach. somewhere and they came and they got a call up to come and play. Blame the administrators. They did the call up. They are the ones manipulating. Behind it, let's talk about why Seminyo was removed. And you have a double, right you have, you a, have double a double player. arrowhead hey. action. First of all, the <laughs> team itself is not a high scoring team. <laughs> we don't score it's a lot a of high goals. Defense team either. Do you understand? You you leave the defense for now. It's not a high scoring team. You have a double arrowhead, Semenyon and Kudus. Then Semenyon at no point in time is showing weakness, faltering, or exhaustion. Tiredness, you know. Then you remove him. Because somebody was his player. Mr. Ayu. The dribblings to go. To come and achieve a so-called... Dive uh, penalty. No, a so-called... Uh, what did they say? Before the Afghan, they said uh, there's some... Um, you know, you know, Asamajan has like the record for the, the rec he has uh, to break highest the record. goal scorer. He has to attain like his record. Mm -hmm. So somebody is also trying to achieve a record. And so you have to give him some minutes on the field so he gets a chance. Eh? Number of appearances, number of cups. He has to show up so that he can rack up the tally. Think about it. Think about the madness. It goes against the entire country. Look at how we are upset. Because they, they must achieve the number of appearances. So you are removed, Semenyo. Listen, in any football game, when you, when you, have, defend, when you have attackers that are worrying the opposition, it makes it, they have to concentrate on defending. Meanwhile, at the time that Semenyo was removed, 
Mozambique had higher possession already, already of the ball than Ghana. It was about 59, 60% possession. Already. They already had that possession. Which means that by the natural law of things, they should have scored us and scored us more. Somehow, fortunately, we, we, even though we blame our defense, our defense was tight. That's how come they were hadn't scored more. 60 to 40. Who should, who should be winning? But somehow, we, get penalty, we, we, got, we won penalties and scored them. Right? So we're ahead. We are head into the 90th minute. It was between the 94th and How the 90th minute. How on earth do we lose this? Minute. By the way, whose idea was it that Richard Ofori should be the one who's the goalkeeper? When, the who hadn't when, when the record so that for over a year, he, hadn't played. he has no play time. And in the most recent international high-level competition, Atizigi went to dazzle for Ghana. And we were all so excited that, wow, look at our goalkeeper. And they sit at the bench and wait for heaven. And the man who went to dazzle at the World Cup in Qatar is sitting on the bench and threw fire out. And you say we shouldn't talk. And if we, if, does it, does, is it sensible? That's the question. Is it sensible? Is it sensible? People are sending their messages already. The question is, that's why I say, Elaine, a lot of people blame the black stars. The journalists were there, they were upset, bring us the players, let's throw that deal with the players. It's them. not the players. The players don't choose themselves. There's no player that's choosing himself. The GFA boys. It's the GFA that's be, choosing they them. They have to be demolished. Do you understand? And the GFA, you see, do you remember that the president said, Hilton is my choice. It's my choice. I will implore yes. on the GFA to keep Hilton. He's my He's choice. His choice. Do you understand? For the people of God. I am telling you that a lot of manipulation is going on. Politics. That's that is politics, it's money, it's a whole the black stars, they have not done anything. Richard Ofori that is there, somebody decided to pick him. But then again, he should because have known not to touch the ball. Man. He should have known not to touch the ball when it will create a goal Listen. Kick. Listen, your oh. capacity is your capacity. Where you fought is where you fought. Why is he the third place coach in his club? In his club. Ask yourself the question. Not even second. He's the third, third. coach. The, sorry, third place goalkeeper in his club. Hmm. How is he Nobody now becoming is, our, our first one. choice for He's an off call? And we're expected to, to, do so, to do well. Are we serious? Please. Jokers. That's what we are. A bunch of jokers.